Lucy, the iconic early human ancestor, was unearthed in Ethiopia 50 years ago this year. We asked Don Johansson, who discovered Lucy, about the fateful day that he spotted her. It was the middle of the day. It was hot. It was well over 100 degrees. I happened to glance over my right shoulder, and I saw a little piece of elbow that allows you to flex and extend your arm. And as we looked around, we saw other pieces. We saw a couple of shards of a skull. We saw fragments of an arm bone. We saw fragments of, uh, of a lower jaw. And that clinched. I knew immediately this was some kind of early hominid. One of the members of the expedition said, you really think it's a female? I said, oh yeah. I mean, the length of the thigh bone is only about a foot long. Well, maybe it's a child. Well, we looked at the teeth and saw that the third molars, the wisdom teeth, were erupted. So this was a mature adult. And she said, well, if you think that, why don't we call her Lucy after Lucy in the sky with diamonds that was playing? And I thought, my gosh, I've just got my PhD. I need to find what its scientific name is. But it was too late. What bothered me was she was found in Ethiopia and she really deserved an Ethiopian name. We had members of the Ministry of Culture at that time come to visit the site, and one of them said, I think she should be called Dinkanesh. And Dinkanesh in Amharic means you are wonderful. And she certainly is.